When it comes to checking luggage for a flight, there are two options, pack light or pay up. But it turns out the scale may not be entirely accurate, making us pay when we don't have to. No, I don't like that. Mm -hmm. Team 12's Nathan Morbido caught up with the people who are trying to prevent this from happening. Is there anything more nerve wracking at the airport ticket counter than walking up to the luggage scale and waiting to find out if your bag weighs 50 pounds or less? If it weighs more, you either have to empty your wallet or empty your bag. Turns out not every luggage scale is accurate. Leah Helfon. I threw a lot of things away. Empties and rearranges her suitcases. They helped me figure out how to balance between the two bags. Hours before she boards a flight to her new home of San Francisco. The last minute stress pays off, saving her an extra $200 in luggage fees. At the airport, every pound matters. Skinny ma matters to, to the customer. But Buddy Dutton knows all too well. It's not accurate. You can't always trust these scales. Sometimes it's over, sometimes it's under. That's why Dutton and his team inspect every scale at every airport once a year. We want each side to be treated fairly. Make sure both the customer and airlines aren't cheated. We tagged along with state inspectors. They rejected six scales in all, or about 6%. What's going on, Tom? Including this one. 26, 24. It was a pound short on three corners and one pound over on the fourth corner. Depending on which corner you placed your bag, the scale could be off in the airline's favor or in your favor. Dutton says of the six taken out of service, four benefited the customer. Two benefited the airline. Dutton says the vast majority of the scales are reliable, but when they find scales that are off... We're going to have the scale company come up here and, and take a look at it. They have a company on site to fix them immediately. A little peace of mind for passengers like Leah Helfont. I was like, oh, I'm throwing everything away. And they were like, no, wait, wait, wait. Flyers who can't afford a scale to be wrong.